Well, we've all heard of DoorDash, the restaurant to your home food delivery service. Now DoorDash has partnered with Jollibee to come up with a mobile kitchen, and one of them is in Hamilton. Ryan Freeman is the head of enterprise partnerships at DoorDash, and here to tell us all the details. Good morning. Thanks for joining, joining us, Ryan. Morning, Bob. Thanks for having me. So this is a, a very innovative approach. As a chains like Jollibee, they're looking to expand, but here's a, a novel way of expanding into markets without the brick and mortar overhead costs. Yeah, absolutely. Um, as a business, DoorDash is focused on, on empowering local economies through, through truly unique partnerships, and particularly as businesses of all types adjust to the, the big shift in consumer behavior to e-commerce over the last couple of years. It's been more important than ever. And this project in particular is exciting because it empowers Jollibee to test new markets and neighborhoods without, as you said, the heavy investment of, of opening a, a brick and mortar store. And so together, DoorDash and Jollibee worked closely to identify the ideal location to launch a unique concept like this and landed on Hamilton as the ideal place to start Based on aggregated insights from, from DoorDash data, Jollibee's expansion objectives, Hamilton uh, proved to be the most effective way to maximize new customer access. And excitedly, this location allows us to service a number of surrounding areas, downtown Hamilton, Stony Creek, McMaster, Hampton Heights, uh, et cetera. So we're really excited. Yeah, so we should remind viewers, you don't walk up to this thing to order, you, you like place orders. Correct, yeah. Um, either through the, the Jollibee uh, online ordering system through their website or through the DoorDash website or, or mobile app. Yeah, now the partnership was kind of a no-brainer because uh, Jollibee Crispy-licious chicken was uh, one of your top orders with DoorDash, isn't it? Yeah, Jollibee has been a, a phenomenal partner for us. Uh, I think Canadians of, uh, you know, uh, across the country of, of, of all stripes and demographics uh, have, have really taken to, to the food. We've been excited about the partnership and any opportunity to help expand and innovate um, was exciting for us. Yeah, now tell us about this mobile kitchen set up on a, on a flatbed. It's pretty state of the art. Yeah, um, it, it's, it's been a really neat opportunity. As I said, you know, we, we, we at DoorDash look to empower our partners to, to thrive online, reach more customers and, and grow their sales. And creating a 15 meter traveling kitchen specifically for Jollibee allows the, the brand to expand its presence in new and existing markets without the traditional overhead costs and timelines of, of a new store. Right, so how and, big is uh, the menu coming out of uh, this mobile kitchen? Yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's, it's pretty, pretty broad. Um, uh, we, we leave most of the menu curation to the restaurant itself, but I think consumers uh, will be really excited to see the, the breadth of, of, of food and, and beverage available to them through the kitchen. Yeah, and the cost range? Very similar uh, to what you'd see uh, you'd see in store. Okay, now, so this is um, a, a pilot project of sorts. How long is it going to be parked at CF Lime Ridge in Hamilton? Yeah, it's it's a great question. You know, for now, we're really excited to set up shop in, in Hamilton for at least six months. From there, we're excited to find new, never-before-served areas with Jollibee uh, to help reach new customers. Okay, and so potentially, I mean, if it's uh, really popular, it'll, it'll just stay parked as long as it's busy, right? Who knows? Who knows? For now, six months is, is our timeline. Beyond that, uh, mm. we'll, we'll wait and see. Maybe Jollibee will have to build a store, <laughs> but uh, they'll know the market is here for it, for sure. Well, we'll link up uh, the website for Jollibee and for DoorDash as well. We got a dash, but we appreciate your uh, time this morning. Ryan Freeman from DoorDash. Thanks, Bob.